everyone welcome back to our channel in this video i would like to start another concept in numerical methods see numerical solutions of ordinary differential equations of first order okay so in this chapter first of all we have to discuss about initial value problem so take side initial value problem So, write the definition. A differential equation, a differential equation of first order, of first order, which is of, which is of the form. dy by dx is equal to f of x comma y. So derivative of y with respect to x is equal to f of x comma y. Here f of x comma y represents a function in terms of x and y. Here y is called dependent variable and x is called independent variable together with the together with the given initial condition given initial condition is called initial value problem the short form of initial value problem is ivp okay so anyway the general form of initial value problem is dy by dx a differential equation of first order with the given condition okay y at x naught the y value at given point x naught is y naught okay so this is the general form of is the general form of initial value problem okay in this chapter we are going to solve the this type of initial value problems by using some numerical methods. Okay, see. In this chapter, we can use following numerical methods. Following numerical methods. To solve above initial value problem, okay, which are very very first method. First numerical method is Taylor series method. Okay, Taylor series method. Second one is Picard series method. Picard's series method and the third one is Euler's method and the fourth one is Euler's modified method Euler's modified method and uh, another one is RK method which is known as Runge Kata method, which is very very important method. Next one is Milne's method, and uh, another one is Adam Bashforth method. These are the numerical methods which are used to solve this type of initial value problems. Okay, actually, we have different type of methods to solve this type of initial methods which are analytic methods analytic methods maybe given differential equation is linear equation it may be Bernoulli's equation it may be exact it, if it is non-exact we can easily reduce this equation to non-exact by using different types of integrating factors 
okay and uh, homogeneous is there non homogeneous methods are there to solve this type of equations that variable separable may very very first method to solve given differential equation of first order is variable separable method okay these all methods are known as analytic methods and also we have some more methods which are known as a transformation method okay by using laplace transformation method by using laplace transformation method we can easily solve this type of differential equation at the given conditions okay but this both analytic methods and uh, laplace transformation methods are have some limitations it is not possible to solve all type of all class of first order differential equations by using analytic and laplace transformation methods that's why we have to discuss about this type of numerical methods also okay every engineering student should gain the knowledge on this numerical methods also okay at the physical conditions it is not possible to get solution by using analytic and laplace transformation method but at some special type of physical conditions we can easily solve the given initial value problem by using any one of these numerical methods that's why these numerical methods are very very useful now today i will explain the taylor series method c see the taylor series method so consider initial value problem of the form dy by dx is equal to f of x comma y with uh, y at x naught is equal to y naught this is called initial condition okay y at x naught is equal to y naught is called initial condition so differential equation together with the initial condition is called initial value problem now we are going to solve this type of initial value problem by using taylor series method okay so the solution of the solution of above initial value problem by taylor series method by taylor series method is given by is given y at x is equal to very very first term y of x is known as solution for this equation y not plus x minus x not whole power on by one factorial into y not dash plus x minus x not whole square by 2 factor into y not double dash okay come on guess the next term which is x minus x not whole cube by 3 factorial into y not triple dash this is the first derivative at, at the point x not and this is the second derivative at the point x not this is third derivative similarly you can write one more term x minus x not whole power 4 by 4 factorial and uh, y not fourth derivative and so on so this is the taylor series method by using this formula we can easily obtain the solution of given initial value problem okay so in the next video onwards i will start the problems on this taylor series method in this method we can get the solution as series form okay that's why the name become as Taylor series method. Okay. See the problems in the next class. Thank you.